building to a crescendo all week and very shortly it will be for real we have all the action for you live Well, hello from Paris, the city of light, and in this case, the city of sun. It's a perfect day for football at the Parc des Princes. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And a lot to be excited about, because coming up for you, action from Ligue 1. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Nice. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Bernat plays with Ashraf Hakimi in the fullback positions. Fabian plays alongside Frankie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. Well, here's how it looks for Nice. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And this confrontation is underway. Bar. Laurent Abergel. Not what he was intending, bad pass. Mbappe. And he's waiting in the centre, unaccompanied. Well, just couldn't quite control the header, and a disappointing effort in the end. Well, it's fair to say, nobody does it quite like Paris Saint-Germain when it comes to scoring goals. Best attack in the league. Well, their forwards should be full of confidence. They've been in fantastic form of late, and it bodes well for the neutrals today. Hopefully, we're in for an entertaining match. And given away. Fabian. Hakimi. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Mbappe into the middle. Still not clear. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here it is again, and when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that, it's a poor clearance, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. And underway again here with PSG in front. Pablo Rosario... A foul, but advantage played. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Mbappe. And Fabian. Hakimi. And green space galore for PSG. 
Mbappe. Tremendously strong in the tackle. De Jong. Is it going to be? And the keeper more than equal to it. Laurent Abergel. Well, it's superbly to take back possession. Chances on. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Can he put it away? And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And from that sort of range, you'd be shocked if Mbappe missed out. He just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Kylian Mbappe. He read it well defensively. Moving it forward. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Fernandez. Mbappe. A really top notch piece of defending. Mbappe. Offside, a tight one. And he stopped them in their tracks. Tere Mofi. He's in here. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. Dangerous looking through ball. Mbappe. Can he find the net? And the shot just over the top. Todibo inching towards the interval and it's going with home advantage Stuart as always very keen to get your take oh they're in here Derek and the referee says penalty this to get themselves back into it and he slots it home with confidence. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? De Jong. Now well, there to intercept. There will be one minute added on at the end. Okay, friend Turam. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor, but he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game.
So back in business here and PSG dominating the proceedings in the first half. Will we see a similar pattern in the second 45? Really bright looking attack. Fabian. It's a perfect challenge. Well, this is one you won't want to miss here on EA TV Live. The second and decisive leg of the Champions League round of 16 tie. It's Paris Saint-Germain against Real Madrid. Well, after that first leg, there's everything to play for in the second leg. With a quarter-final place at stake, it should be a great game. Did well to win the ball back. Might be a chance here. It's still alive. Mbappe. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. And time for the change now. Couldn't keep the ball. Tere Mofi. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Well, we saw what was going through the mind of the referee, but in the end, she says free kick. Well, not a bad plan of action, but through to the goalkeeper it goes. Fabian. Well, PSG have controlled most of the possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. He's going to have a go here. Well, he's got to be cross with himself straight into that human barrier. Mbappe. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Fabian in with a chance. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the action continues. It's been all PSG so far, and you sense there could be extra punishment dished out. And a strong tackle. Nash. How can he take them on and beat them? But quick thinking defensively. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will they profit from this situation? Determined block. Taken short. Can they slot at home? And a time for cool heads. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And there to intervene. De Jong, is it going to be? Corner awarded. Oh, 
Playing it in. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Akimi. And he takes it on. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Over it comes. Struggling to get it away. Couldn't hang on to it. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, the free kick lacking just a little bit of guile. Well, this could be productive. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Five minutes to go. Labon. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Well, in the closing phase here, and PSG excelling, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Applying vigorous pressure. Enzo Fernandez. Return to Hakimi. Lionel Messi. And reading it absolutely superbly. Now, can they create something? And that will be all. Three points for PSG. That's the good news for their fans around the world. Your assessment. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.